Hello? Hello? Hello, this is Deacon speaking. Oh, hi, Deacon. This is Stu. Ah, yes. Good. Did you... Did you mean to call me, or are you... Yes. in touch with... You did? Okay, cool. Yes, I called your number. You left a number on a bit of paper, blue text yep. to the door. So I'm yeah, calling I also, it. I also put it in your phone as well. But, um, oh, cool. It, yeah. It's easier to see on a bit of paper. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. So, um, how are you? Oh, good. Yeah. I was just outside um, checking them in. <laughs> a bit. Subtly changes all the time. It's kind of amazing. Sl it gets slightly bigger and slightly smaller. You know, and the qualities of light from it and around it always changing. I only really notice the the way it's always hidden behind the cloud. Yeah, it's a bit sad when it goes away like that. Um, and then the upside is that it comes out again. Yeah, the big reveal. Welcome to Just Ask Stu. Welcome to the questions. Yes. So tonight's question yes. uh, it comes from Vladislav. Oh, cool. Vladislav wants to know yes. if, because it pertains to me watching the computer a lot, yes. he got a bit pissy and said, why don't you ask Stu about this? If I if can you get burnt to a crisp by watching sunrises on the computer? Well, to be honest, the computer you have the screen resolution isn't that good. Uh, it's a bit of an old computer, and um, I'm pretty sure you'll be okay because it's not actually real sun. It's basically um, individual pixels, and those pixels. There's like a microprocessor in the computer what? and there's a graphics card that drives it and it tells those pixels to turn on and off and each pixel has like a color that it changes to and so it's not actually sunlight it's kind of it's it's like when you if you looked at the painting of the sun would you get would that hurt you it might why if it was they don't know have you ever been hurt by a painting Yes. But it, physically or emotionally? Well, physically. Just no. because because a, an ex-familiar smashed the painting over my head. Right. So it put my neck out for a bit. That's different yeah. though, isn't it? Yeah, like the, the, it wasn't really coming in through your eyes, right? That was like the painting mm. was um, contacting your head. Yes, right. it still went straight yeah. into my mind. True. But um, I, I think that, yeah. Look, I, honestly, it's true. I get it because I've been steering it, that uh, computer, for months, watching sunrises go up and down, up and down. And Vladislav just keeps coming in and saying, Oh, you're still on the computer? And I say, Yes. And he goes, Oh, and he gets pissy. Because to be honest, I think he wants to go and buy some things. Uh, I, think, I think it's fine. But my main concern, concern more is just about the amount of time you spend doing that and you know maybe it's a little bit too much time and so you could spend that time mm. in other ways but I don't think you're going to catch on fire that was it's... my argument also so I think mm. that is, thank you for your concern let us last um, but maybe let's figure out a schedule for sorting out who can be on the computer when <laughs> So what's the moon doing right now? Um, it's kind of basically just gone past full. So yeah, we're on the downward slope now. Oh shit. Did well, you have a big spazzy attack when it was full? Well, I mean, it's been a bit of a rough week, but um, you know, that's kind of part of the course. It, yeah. Uh, you know, we've got our safety procedures and our protocols that we follow. 
we all yes. just read the checklist, go through all the steps, try and do everything to the book, you know, and generally, usually, <laughs> that's okay. Everything works out all right, you know. Sometimes <laughs> there's a bit of damage, but... Yeah, you have a little booklet. Helped. Can't be helped. You have a little booklet with all the steps in it. <laughs> yeah, we've got, like, like um, steps to go through, and we've got, like, laminated pieces of cardboard, so that if it's rainy or there's lots of liquid flying around, then... Oh. Get, like, oh, you're serious. Quite durable, yeah. Oh, I thought you were joking. <laughs> no, no. Oh, um, okay. I mean, it's a bit of a crazy time, so the more we can do to funnel all that crazy energy into a standardized kind of process, the, yeah, the less mm. likely it is that uh, people are going to get hurt. So, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sounds a bit... But okay. yeah, that's over for this month, so... um. It's all, it's all gravy from here on. Yeah. Gravy. <laughs> I prefer to run wild. Yeah. I mean, it would be great just to yeah, throw caution to the wind and just see what happens. But, um, yeah. Yeah. Yes. It's good that we've got this truce going on, yeah. Yes, I guess so. Truce. I was kind of hoping that I could come and meet you guys at midnight and yeah. um, the shit could hit the fan and to have a yeah. bit of fun. With, yeah, um, that, sounds, that sounds doable. Um, I guess we just have to sort out some basic rules Ugh. so that no one, you know, gets actually killed. Well, you they know. don't. They don't think that's going to happen. Okay. Well, last time, maybe we won't talk about it last time. But yeah, um, yeah, it sounds great to me. Um, okay, that'd be fun. I'll talk to the guys. What if I just? What if you guys were up? You guys were t chaining yourself to the tree. Yeah. And I just popped in and went ha like this ha, <laughs> and this ran at one of you. Yeah. And um, just had some fun doing that. Is it doable? Um, yeah, you're welcome to give it a go. Um, but, yeah, I guess it just adds a little bit of unpredictability to the evening. Maybe I won't ask the guys. Maybe you just try it out. I mean, yeah. I think if I tell them, they'll overthink it. And it could turn into a, a weird thing. So maybe just... Well, that's kind of what I... That's what I was hoping, to start a weird thing. Okay. With the werewolves, well, I would hit full go moon. With intuition on that one. Okay, thanks. No worries. Okay, I'll see you later. Thanks okay. for thanks Good for the chat. Share. That Goodbye. was a, that was, just ask Stu. Except he went a bit off on a werewolf tangent, which um, is fine. Yeah. Oh, you're still there. Oh. Should have uh, I should have hung up just then? Oh, who do who does the hanging up? Oh, I guess I should. Um, Maybe I should do that too. Maybe we hang up together. Okay. So we do it simultaneously. Okay, ready? Ready. Go. Oh shit! Wait. Oh shit! Are you there? Hello. Oh, you're still there. Oh yeah, I was just stayed on the line to check that you hung up properly. Oh, Did you just trying to see which working? button to press. So it's not really a button, that's the thing. It's more of just a little panel with little facades on it that you have to press the right one. So yeah. difficult and it's so tiny. Yeah. Cause maybe mm. hold the phone closer. Well it's pretty close. Tell you what, just don't worry about it. We'll hang up later. Yeah, good idea. I'm still here. Me too. Are you still in the closet? Yes. Hmm. What are you doing? Uh, oh, I'm just at my computer. Oh, yes. Just typing up some notes about the moon. <laughs> <laughs> 